recently traded in my old gaming laptop and got this nice Samsung 13.3 inch Chromebook that even has a 10th gen i5 processor. Now, it was pretty fast, but knowing me, I always want to know the specs on it and take a look at exactly what it does underneath. So, what I do, I pull them up and installed COG, System Information. If I click on that, you can see there's four cores and eight threads. But unfortunately, why is the other four hyper threads not doing anything? Well, apparently, from the factory, the way Chrome OS ships is it disables any hyper-threading if your CPU supports it. Sort of like the i3s and i5s, 10th gen, and the Core M3. Some of those have hyper-threading as well. So you're not getting the full potential of your CPU. And the reason why they do it, supposedly it's a security vulnerability. I wouldn't really worry about it. They're just CYAing themselves. So the way to fix this, this way you can get your full amount of performance from your Chromebook that, like this one, I paid $1,000 for brand new. Let's show you how to do it. Go into your browser. And we are going to go to Chrome colon two forward slashes flags forward slash pound sign scheduler dash configuration. And you should be able to find in here, if you don't see it on top, just search for the flags for scheduler configuration. Instruct the operating system to use a specific scheduler setting, Chrome OS. Now see, normally it comes disabled, hyperthread. Click on that. You don't want default. You want to enable hyperthreading on relevant CPUs. Click on that, and it'll pop right here. Your changes will take effect next time you restart your device. So restart. Does a quick little restart. Doesn't do a full restart. And now I'm back in. So... Go in here again. Hey, look at it. There's everything. And that was the initial boot up processing right there. But you can see now all eight threads are being used. You have all your performance. And now some applications will run a lot smoother and a lot faster on your Chromebook. So that's how you make your newer Chromebook faster if it supports hyper-threading. It's always disabled. If you like this video, thumbs up, please. If you didn't like it, thumbs down. Subscribe if you can and share and any comments, go ahead and throw them down below. I'll see you next time.